What's up everybody? Welcome back to A Beer Day with TK. Today I'm doing a special video. This is an unboxing. Um, yesterday you may have seen I did an unboxing with some beers that I picked up from my buddy Pete in Pennsylvania. Um, today is an unboxing of a different variety. If you watch my videos, you may know that I'm kind of a fan of beer glasses. Um, I, whenever I go to breweries or I go to different places, I try to pick up pint glasses or different types of glasses, um, just generally to have, but I also like to drink with them, some of my show in the videos. Um, I was on the internet the other day, being a bit of a doomsday prepper, I guess, and I was looking through a, a website called Coleman's Military Surplus. It looks like they're in Millersburg, Pennsylvania. Um, and while I was looking through the different items they had for sale, I stumbled across some really cool beer mugs. Um, when I read the, you know, the description, it appears these came from some kind of bar or brewery in Germany that shut down years ago. They stumbled across a warehouse full of these glasses and they were for sale. Uh, they had a couple of different ones. So I ordered some. So I'm going to see what they look like. Um, the box looks like it's in fairly good shape. I was a little concerned. Um, you know, it's a little crazy right now with UPS and, and USPS and everything with shipping. These came via UPS. box looks like it's in pretty good shape. And it got here in a pretty timely fashion. It only took about three days. So let's see what we got. The one weird thing, I guess, is um, for the glasses, you didn't really know what you get. It said they had like a wide variety from a bunch of different breweries. Um, so I guess it's a little bit of a crapshoot as to what pops up. Okay, I get a paper. Here's the invoice. So basically it says authentic German pub glasses, two Pilsner glasses and two pint glasses, $14.95. 15 bucks for four glasses. That can't be beat. Then they had vintage German Oktoberfest beer mugs, uh, two pack, $17.95. So I guess about eight bucks, uh, eight, eight and change each here, right? Or nine bucks each, roughly. Um, so pretty sweet deal. Shipping and handling cost me 13 bucks for the order. Okay. Looks like I have some Neutrogena boxes. I assume these will just be glasses in there. If they don't have a raw water full of Neutrogena. And catalog, Coleman's Military Surplus. Looks like the big boys, these are well packed in this huge, heavy packing foam. Now, these glasses they did show on the website. Meisel, Altbrow, Auburn Fees. Pretty sweet. They had two different varieties. They had the dimpled ones or these kind of straight ones. I already had a couple of dimpled glasses, uh, Oktoberfest glasses, so I figured I would go with these kind of straight ones. They have kind of a neat design to them. So there's two of these, and they are the, the same. They came out pretty easy. So I did know I was getting these because they were shown on the site. Now these over here, not 100% sure what I'm getting at all. So I guess we'll find out in a minute. So again, two Pilsner, two Pint. Okay, in the box, feels like some thick, heavy paper as well. First one, Hernbrow. I think Hernbrow was one of the beers or breweries that I did in that 12 Beers of Christmas box. Pretty sure that was one of the breweries. That's pretty neat. Well packaged. I mean, they got them in this heavy, heavy paper. Inside these boxes, inside the larger box, this is a stunning glass. Ballertal Weiss, uh, Schlossbrau, Drockshell Reed. I'll stop butchering German language. But that, I don't know if you can pick it up, has a really cool design inside. The uh, feels like rifling if you touch on the inside. That's a really sweet glass. Never heard of this, this brewery or this beer, but happy to add that to the collection. 
for a few bucks. Again, all four of these, $15 for the four of these that are coming out now. I think if you bought just two of them, they were 10, but then if you added in two of the pint glasses, you got all four for 15. Hocker Shore, Munchen, so Hocker Shore Munich. Let's get this out of here before I destroy everything accidentally. Hocker Shore Munich. And things are crashing about. Paul Lanner. So, pretty sleek glasses there. Um, I also dig this type of pint glass. It's a lot, you know, I guess it's a little bit different than the ones we're used to seeing. So that's pretty sweet. Um, it says on the back, 0.5, and these are the one liter ones. So Paul Lanner, Hawker Shore, Beller, Tall Weiss, Turnbrow, and then these two interesting glasses here from Meisel Outbrow. These are from the Oktoberfest. I think they said this was a brewery that went out of business at some point. Um, and they had a warehouse or found a warehouse full of these glasses. So this was from Coleman's Military. Um, like I said, I think these were 18 for the two and then 15 for the four of those. All in all, not a bad haul. Came packaged really well. I really look forward to cleaning these up and using them in a video. So on Christmas Eve, I hope you guys have a wonderful night. I'll be back later with a beer video. Cheers.